Today, we're visiting beautiful Argentina. Located in the southern part of South America, the country is bounded by Chile to the south and west, Bolivia and Paraguay to the north, and Brazil, Uruguay, and the Atlantic Ocean to the east side. Argentina's population is 44.94 million and is considered a country of immigrants. Argentines usually refer to the country as a melting pot. In the 16th century, Spain colonized Argentina. Argentina then declared its independence in 1816 and emerged as a democratic republic in the mid-19th century, but has since then periodically fallen under military rule. Argentina's diverse geography can be grouped into four major regions. The Andes, the North, the Pampas, and Patagonia. Argentina's capital city, Buenos Aires, is a top tourist destination with a vibrant cultural life. Known for its preserved eclectic European architecture, also known as the Paris of the South, the most visited is the Plaza de Mayo, which is a city square and main foundational site of this beautiful city. Another important landmark is the Pink Presidential Palace, famously called the Casa Rosada, from which Eva Perón would address the enormous crowds. The second most populous city, northwest of Buenos Aires, is a city in central Argentina called Cordoba. Best known for La Mesquita, an immense mosque featuring beautiful column prayer hall and old Byzantine mosaic. After, it became a Catholic church and they added a Renaissance-style nave in the 17th century. Argentina is famous for being the birthplace of tango, originating in Buenos Aires in the 18th century. It is one of the most influential and well-known dances throughout the world. Argentine tango has no basic step. It is a totally improvisational dance. Argentine tango is often danced in close embrace or so-called salon style. It brought together working class, vast European immigrants, indigenous Argentinians and former slaves. As a result, tango has shaped Argentinian culture and society in a big way. Argentina is one of the most biodiverse countries in the world, hosting one of the greatest ecosystem varieties, 15 continental zones, two marine zones, and the Antarctic region. This big ecosystem variety has led to fascinating biological diversity, which is among the world's largest one. There are more than 300 glaciers in Argentina. The most known is the Perigo Morto Glacier, located in the Los Glaciers National Park in southwest Santa Cruz province. It is often called the Blue Glacier because its ice is very dense and all the air has been squeezed out. Another one of the most spectacular sights in South America are these really huge and remarkable Iguazu Falls. They lie along Argentina's border with Brazil made up of 275 different cascades, falls, and deep drops. Iguazu Falls is the world's largest waterfall system. Argentina is very rich in animal variety. The coast of Patagonia is home to elephant seals, penguins, and sea lions. The waters off the Atlantic are home to sharks, orcas, dolphins, and salmon. In the north, there are many large cat species, such as the cougar, jaguar, and the ocelot. The most beautiful of all animals that are found in Argentina is the Andean flamingo. It certainly is one of the rarest of its type in the world. Very little is known of its habits and status or distribution, mainly because of the extreme isolation in the high and desert wilderness region of the Andes. Most popular Argentinians are probably Eva Perón, better known as Evita, the first lady of Argentina of the years of 1940s and 50s. Further, Diego Maradona, regarded as one of the greatest players in the history of football. The Pope Francis, the head of the Catholic Church, and the first from the Americas. 
and one of the most important figures in Argentinian literature, Jorge Luis Borges. Hope you enjoyed our video, Argentina in 5 minutes. Thank you for watching.